Hello, everybody. I'm Mark Womack, and I'm the Chief Business Officer of AGC Biologics, and I'm really happy to be able to present today our end-to-end -end cell and gene therapy offering for the meeting on the med. I really wish we could all be together in person, but uh, for now, this will we'll have to do. And again, I'm really happy to present on this uh, today. First, a little bit, not too much, but a little bit about myself. I have spent uh, much of my career, um, about 25 years of it, in global management consulting with a number of major international management consultancies, including Capgemini. And over that time, I was able to work with many different major industries, including healthcare and biotech. And then ultimately, um, I joined AGC Biologics, uh, the executive team of AGC Biologics, a little over three years ago. And the first thing that I did was I led the integration of the four, uh, the three former CDMOs that became AGC Biologics, um, located across the US, Europe, and Asia. And then about 26 months ago, I was appointed by the board to be the chief business officer, and that's uh, the post I've been in uh, since that time. So now to start introducing AGC Biologics. Firstly, we're a part of AGC Inc. That's our parent company. This is a, a huge company in uh, located or headquartered in Tokyo, although it's uh, for sure um, quite a global company with um, entities uh, around the world. It was founded over 100 years ago um, in 1907 to be exact, and it has core business areas of glass, electronics, chemicals and life sciences, and ceramics. It's actually the largest glass maker uh, in the world. It has over 55,000 employees globally, and it does a turnover of sales of around 14 billion a year. We feel like we're absolutely helping to shape, along with a number of other firms, the future of cell and gene therapy. To that aim, we acquired Molmed uh, in, uh, the, at the very end of July is when we closed that acquisition which is a cell and gene therapy powerhouse, or was, and now we're very proud to say that it's part of AGC Biologics. It was the only cell and gene therapy CDMO that had brought its own product to market, and it was one of the very few, and sorry, we are now one of the very few CDMOs as AGC Biologics that provides plasmid, viral vector, and cell therapy services. And then we were definitely not slowing down we're constantly expanding our capabilities and our capacities across all sites. We'll soon have microbial and mammalian capabilities on all three of those continents, which will be followed by the same for cell and gene therapy. And we're not stopping there, and we'll be announcing more things before too long as well. And all of this innovation and expansion and increasing of capacity is all because it's what our customers need and want, and it's what we think our uh, future customers will need. And so we want to take care of both our current and future customers and their evolving needs. There are three things in combination that we think make us different than everyone else in the marketplace. And I'll talk about each of those three things briefly here. The first one is our global facility network, which is about six facilities located in the US, Europe, and Asia. And we offer across those facilities process development through clinical and commercial manufacturing at the scale that you need. We offer pretty much any scale that you could need. Then we also have a certain brand of technical innovation that we're really proud of. We think that all, all of our competitors have fantastic scientists, brilliant scientists even, and we think we do too, but that's not what makes our technical innovation special. There's a couple of things that we think do. One is that we're continuously pushing, um, the, pushing to innovate, pushing to evolve our technologies and our abilities technically. And then we also think that we're intellectually or technically um, flexible, more flexible than any of our competitors at trying to find the right way, the best way to solve our customers' most complex challenges, whether in mammalian, microbial, or across the cell and gene therapy modalities as well. And then lastly, the first two elements of what we think make us different in combination 
is our customer-centric culture. We think the very way that we communicate, the very way that we collaborate, and the very way that from the very first interaction with our customers or potential customers, that we look for the long-term partnership and the long-term relationship from the very first interaction, we think that's a pretty special combination along with how we communicate all, all along the way. And then here's um, a brief look at um, our, our offerings in terms of going or, or having an offering everything from cell line development and cell banking through process development, analytical methods development, formulation development, and clinical and commercial manufacture. Um, and we do that from, uh, across the modalities of mammalian, microbial, plasmid, viral vector, and cell therapy. We like to say that we're here for you wherever you are. Here you can see the global map of the US, of Europe, and of Asia, and where our facilities are located. And here at the bottom, you see images of each of our facilities, starting on the left in Seattle, which is our headquarters, where I am right now. We offer mammalian and microbial, microbial um, shortly by the end of Q2. Um, we're working hard on that expansion to complete the expansion to add uh, microbial uh, as I speak. And then at Boulder, we have a state-of-the-art large-scale mammalian facility. And then in Heidelberg, we offer both microbial and um, everything up to high-quality plasma DNA. And then in Milan, um, that's the former MOMED that offers both cell therapy and viral vectors. And then in Copenhagen, we offer mammalian and microbial. And then in Chiba, we also offer mammalian and microbial. We have two centers of excellence for cell and gene therapy. The first one I'll talk about briefly is um, our Heidelberg facility, which is our center of excellence for plasma DNA supply in all grades and quantities. And we also offer microbial manufacturing scale from 100 liters up to 1,000 liters. And we offer upstream, downstream, and analytical development and commercial manufacturing experience with plasma DNA. We've been producing a uh, commercial product for um, Bayer Healthcare for um, animal health for, for many years. And then in Milan, following the, the MOMED acquisition, we offer industry-leading expertise in process development and analytics. We offer both cell therapy and viral vector, both for clinical and commercial, and with large GMP capacity. We offer LVV and RVV manufacturing scale up to 200 liters. We are establishing, because we know the market and our customers and future customers really want it and need it, we, offer, uh, we will be offering later this year AAV. And then next year, we're expanding into suspension capabilities as well. We have platform processes and capabilities for gene modification. And we offer more than 160 in-house analytical tests, which ensures faster turnaround for our customers. We are also the exclusive manufacturer of both GSK Stremvelis and Orchards Libmeldi. We offer true end-to-end -end CNGT capabilities. Let me um, share a little bit more about that with you. So we not only offer from tech transfer to process development and quality control and CGMP manufacturing and quality assurance, but we offer them, and we're one of the very few CDMOs in the industry that offers for cell and gene therapy, plasmid plus viral vectors plus cell therapy. This is pretty rare in the CDMO industry for cell and gene therapy. So any combination you might want between plasmid and viral vectors and cell therapy, any permutation that you might want or need, we can offer. And because we offer all of it in-house and because we, ha we have our own platforms and beca because we have over 160 tests in-house, we can offer you greater speed and greater reliability. 
Here on the upper right, we're showing our plasmid viral vector and cell therapy offerings, what we offer today and what we have tremendous experience in, as well as how we're expanding our offerings. And you can see in the case of um, all three, plasmids, viral vectors, and cell therapy, that we're moving rapidly to offer um, what, what our current and future customers need. Our track record does include four commercial products, one for plasmid and the other three for both gene and cell therapy. And we have 13, 35, pardon me, ongoing current programs, 15 cell therapy programs for trials in, in uh, the EU and the US, over 20 viral vector programs for trials in the EU and the US, and then again, this is um, um, about our track record for commercial products. Three, again, for both cell therapies and viral vectors, um, and one for uh, commercial plasma DNA in Heidelberg. We've treated over 300 patients. We've um, uh, done over 230 viral vector GMP batches, and we've supplied for over 30 cell and gene therapy clinical trials in both the EU and the US. This is um, uh, about our um, uh, commercial product for GSK. This is the one for bear healthcare, for animal health. This is our own product, Zalmoxis. And then this is the most recently approved product, LibMeldi for GSK. I'm sorry, for Orchard. We believe we're a proven partner of choice. And this is a sampling of our customer portfolio that we're extremely proud of. You can see there's quite a mix here um, of very um, major large pharma companies and then mid-sized and smaller companies as well across our portfolio. And again, this is a, a small sampling of a number of the partners that we're extremely proud um, to, to, to be serving. And then I'll come back around to um, what, I, what I started with, and that was to talk about the three things that we think in combination make us different. And the first ones are our global facility network, six world-class facilities across Asia, Europe, and the US. We have over 1,600 very talented employees to serve you, and we're continuously expanding and evolving our offerings and our capacities and our technologies to, to make sure that we're bringing to our customers the best that we possibly can. And that also moves into um, the technical innovation side. And we're always looking to be at the forefront of development. And to that aim, we, we are and we will continue to make significant investments in innovation to, meet, to best meet our customers' current and future needs. And again, we will underpin that always with our customer-centric culture and what we like to think is an unparalleled culture of communication and our ability to scale with our customers' evolving needs. I thank you very much for your time and interest, and I hope we'll be hearing from you soon. Thank you very much.